30 to 5 run to start a third quarter when you're tied at 58 at the half. Well, didn't play the same way we did in the first half, but uh, we just missed a couple of shots to start the third quarter. And guys didn't get back on defense. They just moped and uh, they you know, put our head down as we missed shots. You know, they came back and their team that gets out in transition pretty quick and they just hit big shots and got their lead up. You mentioned the word mope. Uh, this team, Randy mentioned it in his press conference, different energy level when you guys are playing well, but if things start to go wrong, there's no energy level. Uh, yeah, I think that's something we really got to figure out. I mean, when you're not making shots, you just got to find ways to win the game, different ways of playing defense and getting those big stops like they're getting against us. And get out of transition, try to get yourself an easy shot. But uh, we're not making shots. We get kind of frustrated, and we let that affect what our aggressiveness that we pull the bring and intensity we pull the bring on the defense end. Where is your frustration about these last two games, in particular the third quarter? Sam told me at halftime that it's just like attention to detail. It's like little things. Um, like I said, basically you just come out. I mean, third quarter is it's like our first quarter most of the time. We don't play good in the first quarter, and then we get down. Third quarter, we can be closer, we can be up, and then we don't play good those first five minutes. And I feel like with this team, that's the key, the most key part of the game for us is that third quarter. We don't play those first five minutes. It's basically a good night for us in a basketball game. Or we're working our way to try to fight from 10 to 15 down, and it's tough and against good teams like this. You know, it's, it's very hard to find your way back into the game. I don't know, so last year we was pretty good at home and not good on the road. That's how you've been in the past, but this year we've been winning a little bit more of our game on the road. But uh, you just got to find a way to get out this funk, and uh, probably it's a good thing we get to get away from D.C. and try to find a way and get our chemistry back together and playing as a team and try to get a win on the road, get a couple wins on the road, and, and come back and try to take your home court advantage because that's going to be key if you want to be a playoff team or if you want to win games, you got to be able to take care of your home court. You also used to beat the best team when they came to town. Now you're thinking one and ten against the team with winning records. How do you explain those numbers? That third quarter, that's our best you see. I feel like we're right there with a lot of teams, and we're fighting that first half and then third quarter. You basically don't come out with that same energy and, and, and focus. You know, we're not locked in and focused like we was in that first half. And the third quarter, those good teams, they know that's when you can put a team down and, and try to get them out the game and give it that knockout punch. Is it frustrating that you shut down Dirk the other night? Today, you pretty much kept Steph in check because you guys still had to meet right him. Yeah, I think he was getting stops. We was getting a lot of stops and they wasn't making too many. But we just got to find a way to, to get ourselves together in that third quarter and we got to get ourselves out of funk. You know I mean, some nights everybody's going to miss shots. And that's something you got to do as a team. And everybody else got to keep playing and let your defense get you aggravated and, and get you to play in basketball the right way. But um, we just keep moving the ball and try to get out this funk and missing shots. But you got to keep playing defense no matter what. I know the East is kind of trending water. Nobody's really picking up ball. Do you feel like you're wasting an opportunity now to get the celebration? Oh, yeah, I think we've been wasting a lot of opportunity, especially when we got to 500 the first time we had those three games that we lost at home and then when we lost that one tough one on the road to Atlanta. And you came back and fought our way to get back and win the games on the road and get back to 500. And it was like we're doing the same thing we did when we got to 500 before. So, I mean, you look at it, it's, it's tough that you're not getting your separation when the time is right, but you're still in a good situation, but not a great situation because teams are losing just like we are. But we got to find a way to win games, man. And then just try to solidify ourselves where we want to be.